a Jamaican hi to everybody on this earth. I like that idea. Oops, you do too. Well, today's weather. Nice blue sky with what's left of Kim Trail, but I don't think that's Kim Trail. But if it was, it was. So today is Sunday, June 4th. June 4th. No seeds, no good. Bummer. But the cush looks good. Hey man. Hey man. What's going on guys? Got water up. Water up? Water up. Water up? The plants. Yeah, water the plants. Go planting today. I gotta go plant today or tomorrow. Yeah. Got to get them in some soil. That's what I'm gonna be growing in. Those buckets right there. Not that bucket. I wish I could get those buckets. I can't in Jamaica. I can get all those though. So we bought a whole bunch, we bought some soil. We just all ready to go Johnny Apple seeding. That needs to be put in the plant pretty soon. It's growing too tall. It shouldn't get like that. Of course it might be a male plant, and I'm gonna keep that male plant. That's a beautiful leaf right there. That does remind me of some kush. Sure does. Trust me, I've grown a couple of strains of Kush in my life. I'm a fan of Kush. What did I do yesterday? I ate that river shrimp yesterday. That was some badass shit. I tell you what, that river shrimp tastes better than lobster or any shrimp I've ever eaten in my life. Better than crawfish. That was some good eating food, folks. That was just better than anything I've ever eaten in life. That river shrimp. It's expensive, though. I paid eight bucks for... Well, it came out to about a... It came out to about a hundred dollars a shrimp, a dollar a shrimp is what I end up paying for almost. Yeah, a little under. And there's some small ones that they, they put in there. But they were eatable. So, uh, I hope everybody had a good July 4th. We didn't celebrate it here in Jamaica. No, no fireworks going off. No bomb explosions. No CIA terrorism in Jamaica yet. Of course, uh, CIA owns the government, so that's the reason why they're not terror terrorizing that nation, because the Queen of England owns Jamaica still. Believe it or not. Of course, some stupid people believe that. Oh, the Queen of England doesn't own the United States either anymore. That's how fucked up some stupid human beings really are in life. I hope she's not one of them. Well, they told me August 6th, August 19th, 
is the big party here in Jamaica. I'm not sure, folks, but it's in August, all right? Coming up next month. That's their Independence Day that they foolishly celebrate like the Mexicans do. Thinking they got freedom from the Illuminati and they're not ruled by the Queen of England. <laughs> Just like Hong Kong. Just like Belize, just like Afghanistan, just like Iraq, <laughs> they still own all those nations, like Argentina. The Illuminati, the CIA, the FBI, they all own that land, still. That's how fucked up our FBI and the CIA agents are. Fucked up in the head, worse than mental retarded human beings are. It's a calm sea today. I might just go swimming today. If there's a little bit of sunlight. Those clouds tell me to stay the hell away from that water. And it didn't rain last night either. And there's a chemtrail I was preaching about. That's not a chemtrail, but damn, it sure looks like one the way it's spreading out. It's just a little teeny one. Something you can't even notice. Yeah, so I gotta do some planting today or tomorrow. I know I could get some more money today. Go in town and go to the ATM machine. Hey, believe it or not, there's this 24-hour ATM machine. And that's what it's called, 24-hour. It's called 24-hour bank. And uh, they don't charge no money to use their ATM. And that's pretty nice. Saves me a shitload of money every month. Because in Mexico they charge three bucks, just like in the United States. Here, they're charging 30 cents in other ATMs. I'm pretty sure 30 cents is what they charged me. Not sure though. And maybe it was three bucks. Well, there's what sunlight you do see. It's coming out of the clouds. I don't know if you can see it. Right there's the sun. You see the sun? Right there she be. Well, not much is happening today. Unless uh, something happens. Uh, unexpectedly like being invited to another marijuana field but that one the other night I was in that I was told I get to go back in next in a few weeks when the plants get bigger I'm gonna film that for you folks it's a badass marijuana field and I had my video camera with me walking around just going man my fucking battery piece of shit china crap Speaking of China crap, I've only been on it for half an hour and battery's probably going dead, so I'm going to have to recharge it today. But, uh, I don't have anything special to eat today. I think I, I've eaten everything in Jamaica that they had to offer. I have. I've tried everything that they threw out in front of me. Yeah, I'll try this. I'll try that. Hell, I'll try this. I'll try that. But the best thing I've eaten, man. I thought that lobster was good. I thought that lobster was just kick-ass dinner, man. I was eating like a king, but you know that river shrimp? I bought a fisherman a beer. A shrimp fisherman, okay? 
fresh shrimps, fisherman. And uh, he goes, you buy me a beer, gringo, and I'll take you out. And we'll go, we're going to go fishing at night time, looking for shrimp at night. And he goes, that's when they come out at night. And apparently they get about this big, this long, with big old huge crab legs. And they said the meat inside those crab legs, ah, oh, good eating meat. I said, okay, here's your beer. We'll be up one night. Now, if I knew where he lived at, I'd be going up tonight. Now, I, it's a half moon tonight, so I'd probably be best going on a full moon night. But I don't know. I don't know how they go fishing. I never went fishing for river shrimp before. Of course, I've never been fishing for shrimp at all in my life. <laughs> I don't think you have either. And if you has, I heard that's one fucked up occupation. A fucked up occupation. Well, I hope she likes the way I look in life. I'm tells you I hasn't taken a shower I'm not beautiful in life but uh you know in Mexico I take a shower every day before I go out to public here in Jamaica yeah I take a shower at night time because I take a shower in the morning time in about two hours it smells like I haven't taken a shower at all in weeks it smells that bad on me Because I try to stay away from deodorant. Underarm deodorant. Not good for your body, I don't think so. But I bought some just to use in case I get around a whole bunch of people. Well, I could show you a not obey again. But I'm not going to do it by my video for the day unless something outrageously happens and uh, let me see if I can have something outrageously happen right now this is called knee berry right when you pick these, you, people are picking these and they're burying them in the bushes everywhere. Because if you pick them and you set them outside, people come by and they just take it. They just think it fell off the tree and landed right on top. Hmm. It has a day or two more to go. So I'll let you see what that looks like when I, when I do crack that open. It is so sweet, this fruit. And it has like about four, four black seeds in the center of it. And you spit those seeds out and you eat the inside. Oh, no, no, no. I take that back. Take that back. Sorry. Those have thousands of little black seeds in it. Yeah, thousands of little black seeds. And you just chomp them up and just swallow them whole. I... Tell you, I only ate one of them so far. Just one, maybe two. Okay, I lied. I ate, I've eaten two of them. Those have three black seeds in it, and we've been eating aki quite a bit lately. Seems like that's the Jamaica's nationality food. I can see it. Well, there's your sun. There's your sunshine for the day. And I've got to go figure out what the fuck I'm going to do in life. First thing I'm going to do is roll a big old huge marijuana joint and light it up after I get done with this one. Well, until my next video, this is what I'll be seeing all day long. A bunch of sea. The Caribbean sea, should I say. Yeah, I'll be seeing a whole bunch of it today.
and the reefs. And that, oh, you know what? I'm glad I remembered this. Do you know that house? On my other video? Yeah, that beautiful house, that beachfront property house. That most beautiful house I've seen so far in Jamaica. I asked them, I said, man, I don't want to bring any bad luck against you guys, but uh, has that any hurricanes ever washed the sea onto your inside your house? And I was expecting a big old sad face and everybody looking on the ground. Hell no, man. Everybody just smiling and says, hell no, man. Seas never came to my house yet. <laughs> I said, what? That's impossible. You're just right there across the, across the street from the beach, man. Your house should have been so... And he goes, he goes the, the dad, he goes, son, you look out there, and there's a whole bunch of reefs out there, way out there. And he goes, when the sea comes in, the hurricane comes in, the reefs block all that water from being washed on shore. The water breaks out there. Just like it's doing right now, everybody. If I can find a... There it is, right there. See how that sea breaks right there? And he goes, Nope, we never had the Caribbean Sea inside our front room before. I looked at that old man and I said, You guys are one blessed human beings on this, sir.